Last October, I received the top secret mission. A challenge so difficult it would shut down my YouTube channel for months. It all started from a message on Discord from a person named Eggbeater353. I don't usually respond to strangers on the internet, but I was intrigued at the mention of a challenge. He sent me a picture of a scroll and asked if I wanted to open it. I was scared, but my curiosity got the best of me. The first thing I noticed was a chart of rare runescape items. And there, in the center, was a dragon cup. Which meant this was not an ordinary game of bingo. No, this one would take place on a special server called the RuneScape League. Today, RuneScape sees the release of the brand's new game mode. Oh my god, we're in. We're in. Everyone's an Iron Man. XP rates are boosted by five at first. Leagues are split up into nine areas. That's right. Without knowing what the consequences would be, or even what the reward was, I signed the contract. Login authorized. Login authorized. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Let's do this. Uh, let's go. Skilling Prodigy. I'm picking this. Run! Oh, I should be quiet. It's 530. I just yelled. <laughs> oh, my God. Wait, where's Rat Juicer? God, we need to <laughs> stick together. Let's get this guy. Oh, I picked the arrows, dude. I'm such an idiot. I fucking picked the arrows. I'm going straight to Draenor, dude. I'm just kidding. I'm gonna I'm gonna go back. I'm done. There's so many people. Oh, wait, we have Skilling Prodigy. <gasps> we have Skilling Prodigy. Oh my god. Honestly, let's go send the Stronghold. Get a few shrimps, send the Stronghold. Then we can buy a Steel Axe and chop Willows and shit. We're already 13 cooking, so. <laughs> the boys... The fucking Iron Man! We march! Draenor's been taken over by woodcutters. Every world's full right now. Oh my god, yeah. Everything's maxed out. We should mine a copper ore here. A tin ore. Oh, he's in <laughs> run! Yeah, give me the money! I'm just gonna fu I'm gonna blow some cash on mine runes. I'll get like 500. I'm gonna save like 1k for steel axe and everything. It's 25 XP a pop. Alright, uh, there's level 8 attack. Thank God for Runelight. Oh my God. This museum's so nice. 
Give me the lamp. We'll get, or the XP. 10k XP. Come on, dude. Just give me one. Just give me one. Please. Oh, I got a copper. Okay, I'm done. I'm out of here. We should burn these runes as soon as possible because that'll give us some fast, fast points. Fuck these rats. Hmm, are there any sad rat images? Hmm. Sad trapped rat captures Zyka. <laughs> Dude, we are, we're like an army. <laughs> the fucking squad, boys. <laughs> we, we fucked up, guys. Boys, we're flying. We're already halfway to our first tier. Smelt a bronze bar. Can we go straight to Fossil Island? Is that quest done? It is done. We can go straight to Fossil Island. Oh my god, look at all the bots here, dude. I love it. Dude, this is the best part about League. It's like packed everywhere in the, all these low-level places. Hey, here we go. 30 agility. Boom. All right, I'm done with agility. I'm just banking some willows. I'm going to keep track of them because I'll forget. Hey, 50 pointer. I got a new relic and I got another 50 points. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's happening? For your second relic, I give you the Eterna Jeweler. Wait, are, are you are you serious? Yes. I make the rules on this challenge. Bitch. Alright, so I guess I, I have some teleport items here. They're unlimited as well. Come on! Thank God, let's not die here. Excuse me. <sighs> Holy shit, this sucks. Dude, I failed this 30 times. You know what? Fuck this place. I'm not saying for 10. <laughs> I paid him again! Fuck! <gasps> yeah, I'm gonna kill- Oh God, the- Oh God, don't kill me. Oh! Oh, 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 Yeah, I'm just gonna kill these, uh, this lesser demon real quick and then hopefully if i get some money be nice i might just train here how many points did i just get i'm at 630 now this is insane xp by the way hey combat level 25 another 10 points any other monsters that would be worth killing Could he one hit? oh god i'm gonna die my mouse is like glitching out yeah i'm getting some weird lag on my mouse here guys I'm, I'm gonna be honest it's just coming back i don't know we start doing pvm it's just weird man just give me the obby cape best in slot please that's all I'm asking. Oh, he's getting fucked up! Oh, he's <laughs> Can I get an F in the chat for Husbu? He lived a short and meaningful life. I'm gonna pick up his bones, dude. I buried his bones. I'm running down so I can pick the, uh, I can do some bronze bars. Ah, uh, someone had the exact plan as me. They sold their oak longbows here, and then they did the bronze bars and they're bought out now. So sad. Oh, we're not the only ones here. I see friendly competition. The resources on the account are 215 GP now. Huz already died, so I mean, <laughs> he got fucked up, man. He was just, doo, doo. <laughs> he got gunned down, bro. Yeah, I'm getting 500 XP drops <laughs> for a trout. Probably sell some of these and I'll probably cook them too. I might just wait to do combat if I can get to two, three. How many points is it? Okay, so that's like 700. Oh, it's a lot. He's gonna die. He's gonna die. <laughs> Yes! Please! Oh, he's dead! Oh, now, okay, I'm out of here. Wait, how do I put my bananas in the crate? Oh, it's this one. Oh, I forgot my GP. Uh. Oh, well, I'm so dumb. I have two GP in my bank. <laughs> Fuck. I'm using this lady's house right next to Varrock East Bank. It's, it's, there's no one in here. I'm just gonna make myself a hoe. I gotta say, I've never used this raid. Shift set! Let's go! Woo! I am fucking out of here, boys. See ya later. We, guys, we can't use the bank, by the way. Okay, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm going to just teleport to Karamja, because it's really close to the, uh, the range, and then I'm gonna sell my fish. As I mentioned before, I get to pick up to three new areas to unlock as I progress through the league. However, I don't get to pick just any area. Whoever made this game of bingo really did his research, because all these items only come from three places. Mauritania, Kandarin, and Esgarnia. Because this is so planned out, I couldn't help but wonder who is actually behind all this. Perhaps I would find out eventually. Ah, uh, do I pick Mortania or Asgarnia first? Or Kandarin? After I pick this, it's it's a lot of tasks to get to the next one. I feel like Mortania might be the play just to get gargoyles first. Dude, and sold Goblin Head? Sells for 20 coins. So I filled up the shop and now I can't sell my trout. <gasps> yes! 
Oh, I just... Oh, I fucked up, guys. I just spam sold all of them. So I just sold, like, more than half of them for zero GP. Oh, it's 38k XP. I'm 40 attack. I've got it. I know what I'm picking. I've just remembered something. A super fast way to get money. I'm picking it. And I'm not looking back. After doing some research at this fishing spot, I learned that there's a quest that gets auto-completed when you unlock Kandarin. Monkey Madness. Which means I'll have access to a dragon scimitar right away. This is a fairly powerful mid-level weapon, so getting it early should speed things up quite a bit. But before that, I'll need to get 60 attack and 100k GP. I'll also be going for an Amulet of Strength as well, which has a massive plus 10 strength bonus. So once I get these two items, plus a few more tasks out of the way, then we should be good to go to start combat. I'm gonna thief some cakes. Holy shit, Kandarin. This is probably the easiest way to get points. Turn on the chalice. What's it gonna be? <laughs> oh my god! Come on, Fire Giant. I know you want to give me something good. <gasps> yes! Yes! Let's fucking go! Ah! I'm sorry. I, I got. I was. I couldn't contain myself. I got moss giants, but I don't think I can. I have no armor. Oh, I don't have level 30 herb lore. I have to keep this lamp in my inventory. Oh man, this takes me back, guys. This takes me back. 120 each. That's not terrible. There's no way I'm going all the way to 50 doing this though. So here's the plan. We'll string some bows. We'll have some money. We'll do master farmer and then we'll do construction. Oh, I attacked the farmer. I'm sorry, farmer. You're dead. Oh no, this guy just died. <laughs> He died to the night. Dude, I almost have a 10k cash stack just from the night. And I also have 5k in the bank, dude. I'm rich. Uh, what do I plant? Potatoes? Onions? Cabbages? Oh my. I can already plant Renars because of this boost. I'm 36 farming boosted. I haven't even done a farm run. Look at all these ham boys. Oh, I don't want a brown rug! Oh, that was the waste of 1.2k. I'm keeping that rug forever. We should just quit. We're too far behind the curve. Bada boom! Oh, wait. It's over here. That was anticlimactic. So now I have all my amulet molds let's get all of these real quick and then i can make a amulet of strength um i just need cosmics all right cosmic runes right away come on mr frog you know <gasps> cosmics it's only two it's only two it's just what i need though the amulet of strength then we got the rune scimitar about to annihilate these moss giants i actually don't have the level that's disappointing. Let me go get that. I'm trying to get Herblore done because then I could use this antique lamp on Herblore once it's level 30. Fairly close to tier three already. Oh my gosh. Rainbows are classic. We're going rainbows. We're go Oh my God. Hey, what is this antique lamp for? Now I have two lamps I can't use. Great. Ba da da da. Hey. Oops. Still five. Is this worth doing? Wait a sec, I have 34 Hunter. What am I doing with my life? Why am I here? I think this is about to turn into how many lamps I can collect in my inventory at one time. Man, we're still going at 97 in the CC. That's incredible. Can we get the rune ax on the first try, guys? What do you think? Nature runes. I know, oh, mithril ax. <gasps> rune ax. I'm not a spoon. Look, look, guys, listen. I'm not a spoon. We're flying through this game. Easy. Rune axe, rune scimitar. I got the mithril and the rune with like five kills. And I was like, man, I might have to be here for a long time. But apparently not. 800 total level. Easy points. And I can keep doing some farming in between. Can I buy Eye of Newts? That is the question. How many guams do I have? 21. XP is gonna be insane. Okay, 200. That's good. Oh, it's not bad at all. We're climbing. That was 10 potions. Maybe we'll we will get to use the lamps. Let's see. Can I use this this one? It's level 30. Okay, so I actually have to have the skill. I can't boost for it. Hey, 4k herb lore. Let's use this one. 2k herb lore. We almost got 30 herb lore. Oh my gosh, these are packed. I think if I just get a full inventory. 30 herb lore. How much XP is this gonna give me? Let's just buy an, a massive amount of wines. That should do. Okay, this is definitely faster. This is definitely faster. For 20 points away. I'm gonna get the last relic tonight. There we go, 70 TV. Hey, hey, let's select it. The tier three relic is a very important choice. It grants a huge buff to one of the three combat styles. Magic, 
ranged, or melee. After looking at the gear that I can obtain from my areas, the melee perk is the most logical choice for me. This is because melee is really good against the Theater of Blood and the Nightmare, which are the two biggest grinds ahead of me by far. So that is what I'm picking for my tier 3 relic. Yes! Give me the Dragon Scimitar! Oh man, I mean the rune was cool, but... Finally, after a successful day one, it is time to unlock our second area, Mauritania. Mauritania contains some of the most interesting pieces of content in the game. But why should I choose this region next? After all, Asgarnia, my other option, grants me access to the Dragon Defender, one of the best offensive items you can get, as well as the God Wars Dungeon which contains 6 best in slot items and 2 of the best special attack weapons. Asgarnia also gives you access to the quest needed for Piety, the best offensive prayer for melee. Unfortunately, my account is still pretty far away from doing these pieces of content. I mean, just look at me, I'm still wearing a wooden shield. Mauritania, however, however, offers one of the best upgrades a low level can get, the Black Mask. This item provides a whopping 16% attack and strength boost. Compared to the Dragon Defender in Asgarnia, the Black Mask provides about 10% more damage per second. However, to get this boost you must be on a Slayer task, so it's not that great unless you're training Slayer. Now usually you don't get to choose your Slayer task, it's randomly assigned by an NPC. Imagine if you could pick the best monster to train on every time that would be incredibly overpowered. But this is the league, and there's a relic called Unnatural Selection. With this relic, I can choose any task I want. So my plan for day two is to get both of these. But I am fairly close to getting my fourth relic. I'm only about 110 points away. So first things first, let's get some tasks done. Dude, we're actually all animals in green DI. The army has assembled. <laughs> Oh my god. Feels like we're on a journey. This is great. <laughs> no way! Can you dismiss it? Oh no, we killed the minecart! Oh, it's coming back! Oh, it's coming back! <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> That's the funniest thing I've seen all day. Die! Oh, 14. Big. 10. Oh, the two ticks so strong. Dude, I'm not going to the north track. I have to go over there. Oh shit. Oh shit. I don't think I survived this. I tick eight. I tick eight. I was two HP. Not a good idea to do all of us at once. So much shit hit me. No! Dude, this is not a good idea. This is a bad idea. I'm gonna die. Oh my god, I'm out. Okay, I'm, I'm bringing out the monks, dude. I'm, that was dangerous. Yes! I got it too. With the completion of the haunted mine quest, I can now unlock my fourth relic. Now that I have unnatural selection, all I'm missing is the black mask. The monster that drops it requires level 58 slayer to kill. So we decided to try a quest that gives us slayer XP. Oh, oh, click. Oh, careful, careful. I can't even search it. Run faster, Huzz. Wait, what is it? Oh God, oh God. I'm, dude, I am in an unnamed area. I'm gonna have to consult the map, dude. I, I've, I'm, I'm completely lost. Okay, I'm going to this one. Of course. Of course. Just please let me go through. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest, guys. Uh, I gave up. We'll come back later, but for now, let's train Slayer. Can I cook these tuna right here? <gasps> no way. There's a raw tuna spawn, and I can cook them on this fire. I'm risking it. I'm not risking it. <laughs> <laughs> Holy, look at it go. I totally forgot. I don't have the level for the high alchemy spell. I don't know how I keep forgetting about magic, but we just need one more level. High alchemy has been obtained and now we are rich. Before I get back to ogres, I'm gonna go grab a spec weapon so I can test it out. One dragon dagger coming up. Oh my God, let's go. It just occurred to me that I have no protection prayers, so I've been doing moss giants for the past like hour or two. All right, here come the DDS specs. We want big ones this time. She's gonna die. 
Where's my drop? Oh yeah, my ring picks up the coins for me. After a few more Slayer tasks, I finally had the level for the Black Mask. <gasps> oh my god, I got it. I got the Black Mask. I got it on t 16 kills. Holy shit, that's insane. What do I do now? I was expecting to be here for like a few hours. To celebrate the early Black Mask, I decided to go to Barrows. Perhaps we would get lucky on a piece of tier 70 armor. Torag's got nothing on this green D hide. You see this? Ah, uh, the tunnel's gonna drain my prayer. Come on, just kill him. Just combo him. Anytime. Anytime. Any. Anytime. First barrel's chest, 100% potential. Let's go. Ah, oh, it's just runes. At the end of day two, my friends and I decided to take on the Theater of Blood. While there's no hope we could actually complete the whole thing at this combat level, there's a chest right after the second boss that has some high level potions in it. Problem is, if you die, it's 100k to get your stuff back. So we only have one shot at this. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I hope we're prepared for death. I'm risking my chaps for the DDS, it's the only way. <laughs> Little nodes, let's go. 75 combat. I'm actually kind of scared, guys. I've never been this scared for a maiden in my life. Oh, big hit. Blood. Oh, that's gonna drain your prayer. Dude, she put three around me. Oh, shit. We forgot about something. I can't even see him. <laughs> we suck. <laughs> I'm just going no prayer. I got nothing to lose at this point. Eat up, son. Oh, no. Dude, I'm tanking her. Well, it was a good run, uh, Mr. Green Dehyde Chaps. <laughs> We've tested the waters. <laughs> On the next day, I did so many Tazar Slayer tasks that I melted my footage. But we didn't leave empty handed. I obtained the Obsidian Shield, which has a plus 5 strength bonus. After that, I continued with Slayer all the way to level 85. This is the level needed for Abyssal Demons, which drop one of the coolest items in the game the Abyssal Whip. <gasps> <gasps> Oh, let's go! Woo! The gear so far is looking absolutely amazing. Look at this. We are stacked. We're going to gargoyles and we're going to use this whip. Ooh, hello, sir. I'm a green man. I love being a green man. Just give me some rune plate legs. That would be super. Or adamant plate legs. The green man lives on. Today's a great day. Now I'm shredding. 38. Rune plate body achieved. I need to save the Addy plate legs, but oh my gosh. Should we try Fossil Island Wyverds? Nice, test complete 75 points. Let's do the fight games. Yep, this is it. This this should work well. Go with eight sharks. Let's try not to die. I forgot how overpowered the, uh, the rapid heal thing is too. Eight HP every minute. Bada boom. Fire cape complete with the melee setup. Look at the upgrades on this account. My god. Come on, give me the rune boots. Everything else has been spooned. Just give me the rune boots. Make my day. Neck reels. I've already made over 100k. This is insane. Hey, the attack. 100 combat. Rune boots! Yes! The newest and improvedest upgrade. I butchered that. Um. Huzzah! Oh, I'm having fettuccine, baby. Some shrimp fettuccine. There we go. 50 construction. I'm gonna wait. <sighs> I need a break, so I, I'm scooping some sand. This will be used for crafting later on. All right, we need to go to a furnace. Let's wear my whip so I can flex on these people. I have no idea if this is gonna work. Oh, it worked. We're only 680 points away from the next relic. The botanist. The botanist relic means I can make a lot more potions for less. But there's also a hidden feature built into it that makes it very useful for bossing. You see, normally, when you sip a potion, your stats go up and then they decrease by one level every minute. But this relic prevents that from happening. So I drink one dose of super attack and super strength and my stats stay at their maximum. As long as I don't reset this boost manually. So let's get this thing unlocked. All right, that concludes day number three. Tomorrow, we finish Slayer. Okay, let's unlock the Slayer helmet for 400 points. Level 87 Slayer. We now have the level for the Kraken. Cave Kraken task acquired. This is like the fifth time I forgot that I still need to train magic. All right, 80 magic. Let's get out of here. Yeah, the Obby Caves were insane. I got like four <laughs> back to- <gasps> I'll shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! 
27 KC. I have three times drop right now though, so it's it's not super spoon. I guess we're gonna have to grind magic, but let's go kill the boss, dude. I need to buy a lot of oh, death rune stuff. I was just talking about the charges too, that's funny. Man, if only I had something to attach my whips to. <gasps> Fuck this task, we're done. Where's my whip? Let's add this to the abyssal whip. And now we have an abyssal tentacle. There's 84, let's go, baby. There they are. Pick the flower. Okay, I'm just gonna, I'm, this is fine. This is fine. Make these. And now we have the level, 87 magic. Dude, I look straight out of 2007 right now. There we go. One onyx has been purchased. Let's go cut this bad baby. Onyx bracelet. Let me just show you the difference. Mmm, look at that. Amazing. All right, just easy, couple more whips and we're golden, man. And we're ready for Tob. Hey, there we go. Look at that, it's so beautiful on the ground, my God. Oh my God, what? I, did, I wasn't even looking, I got another whip. Hey, what is that? What is that in my inventory? 70 ranged and no back-to-back -back heart. Wow, sad game, this game sucks. That's what we're looking for. Okay, my black D headset. Hey, the spoon strikes again. Come on, let's pull something big. Let's pull a rune pickaxe. I really need a rune pickaxe. Man, range sucks so bad. Hey, a 432 kill. Not bad. Is that a ranging potion? Boys, the dragon mud helm has been achieved. Look at that. Oh, keeping that. Rune pickaxe. I'm a fucking spoon. We got a unique, guys. Granite gloves! It's definitely worse than the regen bracelet, but that's funny. Hold up, let me set my quick prayer so I can at least... It's dangerous to flick, by the way. Are we ready? Oh, humble spawn. I got screwed on the blood there. Not bad. Holy shit, dude, it's so scary! Dude, we beat the theater of blood! Are brews actually worth it? I think prayer pots are probably the best. I mean... Maybe Mantis. If you guys want to get whips, we can come back. I can get my Xenites going too. I just got five prayer pots. Look, I may not go outside much, but I know my survival. I'm ready for gorillas. I'm doing this whole task. I'm here mostly for the Alps as well. Ballista Spring. That's a dupe. Of course, dude. Of course, and it's a spirit seed. That's for a task. Oh my God. Wait, I buy this? Where the hell did I buy this? I need help. I'm lost, dude. I told you I need this ghost speed game. I feel like I was just here. And then I somehow I ended up in lumber. <laughs> when did that get there? <laughs> Cha-ching. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm ready to slay. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold the phone. 90 and 92. Oh, that's way better. Okay, fuck the you. I don't trust these fools over here. I don't trust... Especially that man with the amulet of accuracy and the harpy bug swarm. <laughs> <laughs> the lantern. Oh, this brings me back. Oh yes, the tentacles just slapping. Stay on her. I'm doing. I'm doing big hits. The whips. I'm. I've switched to the whip. Stop being mage. Ah, there's nothing I can do. I was so close, bro. Nice. This game's easy, dude. You just have to play the game, you win. Oh my god, we're just shredding, boys. I'm actually hitting, dude. I think this is way better. The maces were doing fuck, fuck all. No to fail. Charge the pillar. The first nightmare kill of the boys is complete. Good luck. Hey, not bad. Oh, nice, I got a second one, dude. At this point, I decided to hunker down to complete as many tasks as possible so I can unlock my last relic. Look at this, dude. <laughs> sit the fuck down, tortoise. Oh, they, they attack me. Oh, sit down. <laughs> sit. <laughs> Look, they have a blue wizard robe on the ground. They're not even here for the task. Trying to get some loot here, my man. I need robe. <gasps> got it. So I sold my those items back. I still have 172k, which means I only need like 100k total for a freaking uh, Fury. I forgot to equip them for the task. So I had to buy them again and lose more money. Smoke devil task, boys, let's go. 
All right, I'm done. I got the occult necklace. One more task, boys. One more task. I'm gonna make my Zenite for the last task. I sold half my stock without the gloves. <laughs> Fuck, dude. My money. Oh my god. Dude, this has been the hardest fucking journey trying to get this damn onyx. I have 93k. That should be enough. 260k. Let's get the fuck out of here. I have to be a zombie monkey. Ugh, why would I have to be a zombie monkey to make the amulet? Oh, yes. Yes! Boom! Last area unlocked. Do -do -do -do. Wait, I thought this ring had stats if you don't abuse. I'm dumb. <laughs> I've waited long for this moment. Wow. Wait, Verzik's right behind that door? Dude, he has his legs are together <laughs> wait where, why'd you go in here this isn't the right way is it oh there's oh there's a trap door <laughs> it fooled me oh this, this guy sucks i'm fucking him up with this perk buzzing gonna get me 70 prayer probably wait there's another one and there's another one with the completion of a taste of hope quest i had finally unlocked my last relic After six days, I had unlocked all relics in all areas, but my adventure was far from over. So if you'd like to see part two, then be sure to like the video.